Check out this wide angle view. What y'all think? <laughs> Welcome back to the channel everybody, I'm Ochi. Thanks so much for coming back and watching my videos. You all are the best. Today's gonna be a kind of a different type of video. I really, really, really need to work on this room. As you guys can see, it's still an utter disaster. So I'm gonna just film myself bringing in a lot of the collectibles from the spare room because that's where a lot of my vintage Sailor Moon stuff is. And I wanna work on this area right here, which that's gonna be where most of my vintage stuff is gonna be as far as toys from the 90s. So that is going to be what this video is about. I'm thinking it might just be an hour and I'm not really gonna cut too much out of it. I want it to be like just everything. Like you're just gonna see everything. So there's not gonna be a lot of talking. Um, I'm just gonna have some music. We're just gonna chill. We're all just gonna chill and I guess you're just gonna watch me organize my collection. Really, that's what this video is. If you're new here, welcome. Like I said, I'm Ochi, I'm a big toy collector. I just remodeled this room recently and I'm getting everything where I want it to be. I collect Disney, I collect Pokemon, I collect My Little Pony, some Monster High, mostly Sailor Moon, so that's what you're gonna see. But if you guys are new, definitely hit that subscribe button. Join me here because I'm going to be doing a lot of content revolving those series that I just mentioned once this room's together I want to do a lot more types of series content like not just Sailor Moon so hopefully you guys are excited for that let me know down there in the comments like what you want to see in my collection like what you want to see more of maybe I'll do like um, my L.E. Disney doll tour or something I don't know but if you have if you see anything in this room during any part of this video let me know some feedback down there in the comments on what you want to see more of and once it's in order we will definitely revisit the stuff that you guys want to see since it'll be so much more accessible like I'll be able to be like oh they want to see my My Little Ponies I know exactly where they are and I can get to them easily so yeah let definitely let me know what you guys want to see more of and uh, we'll, we'll get to that soon. But yeah, I think we're just gonna go ahead and get started. You're going to notice me coming in and out of this room a lot. Like I said, there's not gonna be a lot of talking, so it's just gonna be kind of like a chill video. And I hope you enjoy this type of video. Let me know what you think of it um, after you watch a little bit of it. I'm gonna have my glasses on because I am blind and because of the light situation, it's gonna be definitely reflecting so um please disregard that if you can i won't be really talking to the camera anyway so hopefully there won't be that many glares that you guys have to deal with <laughs> just sit back and watch me unload my collection Woo. first thing what i need to do is i need to create like some sort of walkway so i'm able to walk in here there's so much merchandise on the floor at the moment. So we're just gonna kind of create a path. Yeah, look at that, look at that path. And that'll be what I stand on. Yeah, cause I need to, this is where I'm gonna be working on mostly. I also need to clear off some of this stuff for sure. So I will work on that. <clears throat> Look at this! Trash everywhere. Have a collection, they said. It'd be fun, they said. Kylo Ren. What you doing, Kylo? Look at that nice freaking space. Oh. Howdy, howdy, howdy. I'm just being silly. You guys, I am super silly, so don't take anything serious. I'm not serious. <laughs> Ooh, we got a lot of pretty stuff though. I mean, I've got things to show you guys once this room is in order. Some stuff you may have never even seen before. I can't wait until this is done. It's gonna be so epic. Like, 
all my hard work of collecting over all of these years, you know, not buying food and clothes that aren't Sailor Moon pays off. Sky Dancer. Go over there. Sailor Moon over here. Okay, these are vintage. So I'm going to try to keep all my vintage stuff together because that is where these will go. Luckily, I have a lot of them like just right here. I try to be careful. The vintage stuff is delicate. That's where you want to be extra careful. Oh, I forgot I got this. Love the box. I'm also going to have to have an area for my books. They get like, I don't know, what do you call them? Bookends or something. Got a fat stack of media over there. Oh, the room fragrance. Don't open stuff up, Brooke. Don't open stuff up. We can get to that later. Here's the Dolphy outfits I've never opened up yet. That's coming soon as well to the channel. I know a lot of you guys want to see me transform my Sailor Moon Dolphy into Super Sailor Moon. That would be cool. We will definitely do that. Oh my gosh, isn't this pillow adorable? Stuff it in the pillows right there. Oh, Mars's uniform. Ray. Another pillow. Oh, this is a Sailor Moon World pillow. Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought I had all my Sailor Moon World stuff done, but I guess I don't. Ami and Usagi's school uniform. Oh my lord, why am I like this? All of this is Sailor Moon World. I'm trying to keep all my Sailor Moon World stuff over here, so that's gonna be fun to go through eventually. Whew. Oh, I'm already winded and it's only been a few minutes. Having a big collection is a lot of work. Um, let me know down in the comments if any of you guys have big collections of any type of series. If you guys have any tips on organizing a big collection, I'm always open ears to tips and tricks on organizing big collections. Oh, these are Ichiban Kuji displays. I forgot I had these. Where am I going to put these? How cool, though. Like, that was the... the um, how many years ago was this one? 2015! That was the Kuji from 2015. Oh, that was so cool. This one was weird because it mixed 90s and crystal. That's interesting. Okay, we'll put that probably on my desk for now. Oh, look, we're getting there. We are getting there. Vintage. Move that down there. Gotta be very careful with Please, just move it over here for now. Oh, and all this little gash upon stuff I have to go through eventually too. That'll be fun. Hint the sarcasm. Sticky hearts. Tablets. leg. Ah, the Luna mirror from Hot Topic. I remember that. Oh, fall down, don't fall down. <laughs> okay, what we got going on here? Plates. Oh my gosh, all of these plush. Honestly, why did I collect those? Also guys, as I'm going through my collection, I will be getting rid of some things and I will be posting those for sale. I think first I'm gonna go through my Twitter super follows. I just got approved for that. So if you guys want first dibs on anything that I have for sale and you have a Twitter account, um, follow me. Well, super follow me. It's $2.99 a month and it really helps me as a creator be able to continue to be a creator. And also there's going to be perks for you guys as well. I'm going to post everything that I have for sale there first going forward. So you guys will get first dibs. And that is on my Twitter. I am at Oshiba Wolf on Twitter. 
if that is something you're interested in. I can't wait to like give you guys the full tour of this room when it's done. Because, like I said earlier, you guys are going to be amazed at some of the crap I have. Like, come on now. How many people do you know have a full-sized Cosmic Heart Compact shopping bag? Official. <laughs> oh, my Lisa Frank folder from when I was a kid. More Kooji stuff. I think I have a whole bunch of these somewhere. What did I do with the other ones? Well, for now, it's going to go here. <laughs> oh, yeah, my displays. Oh, I know where the other ones of these are. Go down here. Perfect, perfect. That one's cut up. I think I have to remove one of these anyway. Probably gonna remove this one. Cause some of my items are so tall that are vintage. Dismushed Face Luna from USJ 2019. More cash upon! Oh lord. I gotta take those out of their balls. <laughs> Alright, got the figure arts, vintage stuff here, some books. Put these in the book pile. There we go. Figure arts just forever for now. Yeah, so I'm gonna keep this one just one layer removed. Yeah, that's what I said I'll do. Ah, Luna, Luna fell on the floor. We got you. We got you. We saved you. More dash on. Okay. These are vintage. Oh, she's so cute. Gotta get her out and do an unboxing of her sometime. Alrighty, I think we are ready. We moved those, and then I think this is the one that's, that's going to be removed. Yeah. Yep, yep, I've decided. Oh, and these are metal, so these are a lot heavier. I'll have a link down below what shelves I use from Ikea, in case you guys like these. Hi, baby boy, what are you doing? What are you doing? Is it already looking better already? Cleared things out. Okay. Seriously, guys, do I need any more little mini notepads? Please say no. I do not. I'm running out of space to put stuff on my floor. out of room. Maybe I can stack them right here for now. Just for now. I haven't decided where my figure arts will reside for most of their life yet. God, I love that. It's so beautiful. Okay, things down here. Okay. Oh my gosh, I remember all that makeup we went crazy for. Hmm. When was this? Does it even say? It was like one of the only Sailor Moon products out at the time, so a lot of us fans bought these. Yeah, 2014, yeah. Yep. I'm sure a lot of you guys remember that or started collecting around that time. Let me know if you guys collect Sailor Moon and when you started collecting. 
Everybody's different. They all started at different times. Set that there. Moving things out of the way. Okay. I'm just going to put this somewhere. This is my Makoto CD Japan fabric poster. I really would love to hang this on the wall. Got to keep it nice and scratch free. I'll put it back here where it should be safe. Okay. I love little cute dishes to put some of the smaller knickknacks in, like from Target and stuff. Oh, I always look at that kind of stuff. Like, see this little basket? Just to kind of, you know, help organize stuff, or at least <laughs> once I get my collection organized, I guess that's. <laughs> what it'll be used for. Okay, now I think we're ready to start putting the vintage stuff up. That's really gonna help clear out a lot of space for me. A lot of my vintage stuff is in here too, I think. Yeah, it's definitely vintage. So now that I removed that, the tallest thing that I have are these excellent model figures. And that's what I was having trouble with. Yeah, and then I can just maybe use a riser or something and prop those babies up. Let me go see if I have some boxes so we can start that. All right, I found some boxes. Collector tip for you guys. If you display or open up any of your items, save the boxes because they make great risers and you can always hide them by putting more items in front of them. That's what I like to do because I don't want to buy a whole bunch of plastic. So that is what I'm going to do for these, I think, is just find the one that works the best. Obviously, that's a little too tall. That might be just about right. Yeah, I like that a lot. And I have a whole bunch of these sized boxes. Maybe something just slightly taller than this one. Yeah, I guess that'll be too tall, right? Yeah, almost. Okay, so I'm going to go look for some more. These two are pretty darn similar, so maybe this will work. Oh yes, 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 okay. So how do I want this? Do I want these all the way in the back maybe? Yeah, Sailor Moon up higher. That would, that would make sense. I don't have Venus yet, so right now I only have uh, Mercury and Moon. And Mercury and Box is opening up at the bottom. There you go. Yeah. I might even be able to put them both on here so they're both the same size. So, yeah, there we go. There we go. That's nice. That worked out great. I want them. Yeah, there we go. Most of them probably right there. Yeah, so you. Just a bit. There we go. Perfect. Then I can have something over here. I know I have my smaller excellent models, which I gotta find what I did with Chibi Moon, Uranus, and Neptune. I did something with them. Yeah. Is probably to be taller. I mean, I probably can go even taller with a box. This one was pretty tall, right? Yeah. Yeah, it was. Chibi Moon's compact. Yes. Okay. Love it, love it, love it. Let me go see if I can't find Uranus and Neptune. I think they're out there on my hallway cabinets on top. They were. I gotta find Chibi Moon though. I know Chibi Moon is somewhere in here. I just saw her not too long ago. I just don't know what the heck I did with her. Found these two. Where is Chibi Moon? Hmm. Did I put her in here? Aha! I see her. I see her. Can you spot her? She's over here. Let me know if you find her before I do. Should I put Chibi Moon next to Moon? 
because there she is by the way you guys were right because she's smaller she's a lot smaller maybe i can put her down here maybe propped up a little bit yeah that's what i think i'll do because i also have some wands and stuff that are really tall um yeah the moon kaleidoscope is pretty darn tall so are these right here the eternal tiaru or the eternal tiare sorry <laughs> the way that this looks honestly like those are gonna look cool i mean obviously i'm gonna do a display maybe based on season that would be nice so oh i should probably put her up there too though shouldn't i because she's the korean version of that one hmm that matches. These are pretty tall. I wonder if this will work. The glitter and glamours boxes. Pretty tall. Let me see. I think they're a little taller, but that'd be okay. That'd be okay. Yeah, because she's a little shorter anyway. It looks like. Cool. That works. Oh, and they almost fit perfectly. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, that works. I'm a fan and look, see how I said you can hide it? Like, you're gonna hide that space with another box. Yes, we are. But do we want her to go over here? Do we want her right here? Yeah, because we want the wands to go in ascending order, right? And I don't know, do I have the moon stick? Do I have the original moon stick? I know I have the 2011 one. I don't think I have the OG one that came out in the 90s. Let's see. Yeah, I don't think I do. I don't even know where my 2011 one is, to be honest with you. Where is that one? It's probably in the room, the other room still. Yeah, it's not That's okay. I'm thinking too much into it, I think. Um, so... I don't want to think too much into it. No, no, no. I do not. I just want to get everything up out of the way first. A lot of mine are mix match too. Like some are from the 90s, some are from the early 2000s. And some are doubles. <laughs> I have the 90s version and the 2000s version. So we'll just do this for now until I see what I have. Oh, this is looking so good. Puts five items on. Oh, we're done. This looks good. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, man. And I know I have the moon kaleidoscope, so. Oh, I love it already, guys. I love it. I love it. I love it. Mm, nothing beats the vintage stuff. Nothing. Oh, but I have this like little space right here. I do know I have another wand. I do. I have like Chibi Moon's Peak Moon Stick and the Star Power Guardian Stick. Would it be weird to put Chibi Moon right here? Would it be weird? Yeah, if you guys have any ideas on what looks better like if this doesn't look good to you and you have a different idea please feel free to give me some suggestions i would love that honestly because this is not this this may not be the permanent like display the only reason why i want to get this like just on the shelf is to get everything off the floor so i know where everything will be and then if i want to redo how it looks that'll be easier versus everything just everywhere so this doesn't have to be it's final final thing off 
Here is my knife. Here it is. I hope these videos are relaxing to you guys. Let me know. I'm by myself. I'm just by myself doing this. I do not like those at all. I don't know. I might need some goo gone to get this off. You know what? I can probably hide it by sticking something else on it. For sure. So. This one needs to be bent a little bit more, I think. Oh. There we go. Yeah. Alright. This matches a little better anyway. That should pop out a little bit. Do I have more than one of these? I mean, more than just two? I might just have two. Oh no, I have three, but I put them over there. Maybe I should have one on each side, right? Maybe not side by side. Yeah. Alright, cool. Oh man, that's a big chunky one. Pegasus. The Pegasus can probably go down here, honestly. And I can put a lot more little things. Yeah, and I think some of these, yeah, totally can fit down here because they're not as tall. Yeah! So my tall stuff gets taken care of up there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Little bow sets. That kind of fits perfect right there except that thing does not like to stay up, so. Oh my gosh, here's my moon stick. It's right in front of my face the whole time. So it obviously has to go over here with the others. So then we get rid of Chibi Moon then, right? Yeah, hers can fit down here. I'm gonna put her shit down there. Yeah. Slide it on over so we can fit the moon stick. And then that should conclude the wands for Sailor Moon. Oh god, is she not gonna fit? Oh, actually, that one can. So the plan for this shelf right here is the end of my Sailor Moon stuff. So this should be like probably my My Little Ponies and Monster High and stuff. So I don't want to go too far into, but it's okay if she's kind of hidden just a little bit. Yeah, that works. That works. And that one can also slide just a little bit and overflow on the other shelf. Yes. Perfect. Been cool so far. I hope it looks good on camera though. We're getting there though. We're getting there. I'm kind of like weird what to do with some of this stuff. Like I can fit something on top of that one. But what is the question? Would look good. Oh my gosh, I forgot I have a whole bunch of these. Like would that obstruct Mercury? No, not really. Not really. That's my Japanese one. That one took me a long time to find. I had the Hong Kong version of that for a long time. Okay. Well, those are almost, almost perfect for, for that. I don't know. Do I like that? Doubt. Something probably thinner would look good. Yeah. music box. The music box is weird there. Maybe something more flat? No, because then that would obstruct it all. And then maybe some little things, maybe? Maybe? Do I have some little vintage things that can go there? What about some of the compacts? Where are my compacts? Oops, sorry, didn't mean to hit ya. I'm missing my compacts. They must be somewhere else. Because, yeah, we should probably put the compacts up there, too. Okay, this is Chibi Moon's compact. 
So yeah, let's do Colfax up there. Ooh, piece of hair. Look at all. Yeah, and I think I just saw some of my Colfax. These are some of them. I think they're just my Cosmic Cards. <laughs> okay, yeah, I have too many Cosmic Cards. It's because I wanted the perfect Cosmic Card and I could not, could not like decide which one I liked better so I decided to keep them both because they're so hard they're so expensive to replace like if I sold one and I regretted it it would be like double the cost so I decided to keep them both oh my god I've been looking for this <gasps> okay good 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 that goes all oh, oh, there's my other moonlight memories ones Compact, compact. Okay. So first season transformation brooch there. We're gonna have the crystal star here. <laughs> my two cosmic hearts there. And then where is my Crisis Moon Compact? Oh gee. I know I have it. Where is it? Ah, is this it? No. Oh crap, I forgot. I, I did keep the Hong Kong version too because they're so crazy. So the Hong Kong version has stickers and then the Japanese one has jewels. So I thought that was kind of cool to keep for like a um, comparison video. So I did keep them both. So I'm going to have to find out where I want to put that one. Also, I'm so glad I bought all this stuff back in the day when I lived with my parents because nowadays I could not afford all of that. I really cannot find my crisis moon compact the 90s version it must be in the other room still oh it looks good though oh i'm glad i went in there i didn't find the crisis moon compact but i did find some more of my 90s figures like more of the excellent models now i'm like crap what am i gonna do with those <laughs> i hope they fit somewhere else i wonder if they fit on the ceiling probably not I'm gonna have to redo that whole thing. So weird, I can't find Crisis Moon Compact. Oh, I hope these fit up here. Oh, yay! I can put them up there. Perfect. I was worried about that. So, yeah, these can totally go up there. Somewhere. This, which is being covered by stuff right now, of course. Do, 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 do. And get them up there. Okay. What is this? Oh, that is a poster. That is a poster. Okay, we gotta have fighter first. Healer maker. Yeah! Sweet! I'm glad that worked out because I did not have any more room for super tall stuff. I couldn't remember how tall those actually were. Whew! That is looking good so far. You know what? There is some vintage stuff hiding in here. I bet it's under all this crap. Yeah. We have that. Buddy, I hear you! I'll come out in a little bit. I'm just doing a video and working on my stuff. I know. Can you guys hear my cat? He is crying like a little baby. He is a big baby though. Not no little baby. He a big baby. He a big boy. Maybe these are just bags. Are these just bags? Oh my God. Here it was. Oh my gosh, it was buried in the pile of crap. Oh, thank goodness I found it. I was about to lose it. Ta-da! Ooh, look at that. It fits. Oh, that's so cool. That's so awesome. We have a little space right here. But that ain't nothing. Oh, that looks so good. So good. I'm excited, guys. How long has this video been already? I know this is still a mess over here. 
I still am undecided on like what what to put over here. I kind of wanted to just to get my vintage stuff over here, get that out of the way first. But yeah, woo! -hoo! I've got a bunch of shit. Okay, let's get all of it out. What are we gonna do on the top? That's kind of where I'm. Like maybe super stuff down here. It looks like a lot of that is supers. So yeah, that's that's a good idea. So I'm gonna just pop a squat right here and work on this section oh yeah this is just a display box Luna. okay super yeah this, this would be cool i wonder if i should prop up some of this stuff two versions of the uh carillon the bell I know I have another, don't I have the supers version of that one? Somewhere over the rainbow. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I have the supers one. That's the S version. Damn. Not knowing where your stuff is. I think I'm going to use this box to prop something up. Oh, that might, that's too tall. That's too tall. Maybe not. Change my mind. But I need something to prop some things up. I love how there's a real bell on that one. Yeah, we're gonna need to prop some stuff up for sure. Oh man, I've got the disguise pin. Let me go see if I can get some more boxes to help prop some of that stuff up with the RV. Don't want to step on this. Yeah, I found some pretty good ones. It'll give it a little bit more height than what it is now. So we'll do that. Yes, perfect, 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 perfect. Don't you fall down on me. It kind of sucks that it's so wide, but it's okay. And then these are the same height as well. Some of this stuff doesn't need a riser though. Yeah, so maybe I won't need to do some things. This will kind of shield some of the stuff down there, but that's okay. That's okay. Any other tall things? This one is pretty oh. tall. But, so, oh yeah, it will make sense. Star stuff over at the bottom. Oh my god! Good thing it hit that pillow. I'll have to put something in front of this because that one does not like to stay. Maybe for now, we can put this in front of it so it doesn't fall over. Unless they just both fall down, then we're... Okay, so slide those down. And then this one. We can slide down some more. Oh, there you go.
be a third eight. the last of my tall things, honestly. Put all the chibi woo stuff down there. Watching you disguise Finn. Yes, I am. I'll work on you in a bit. That fits almost perfect back there. Maybe a little box to pop. Hide those. Kind of hide the compacts a little bit. Maybe. So tall, I feel like. I think I'll take it high. I think it's this one. Ooh. Let me go see if I can find some more of my vintage stuff. Yes, this is vintage. Oh, this is tall. Got lucky that it fits. <laughs> Crash! Did everything actually stay in place? Wow. Would you look at that? There you go. Now we'll fall down. I know I have a lot of these somewhere too. They are uh -huh, there they are, they're down. some lunch <laughs> haven't had lunch yet so i'll probably be cutting this video short well not short like just cutting it done after i finish maybe i want to get everything up here you know so maybe after i finish the top shelf and then maybe the two down here maybe i just have to find more vintage stuff because that is what we're focused on with my silver knife you guys know they made a silver knife yeah once i get this room done we're gonna be looking in detail had a lot of this merchandise for sure but yeah i gotta go in that other room again it's still not cleared out you guys would be shocked my baby boy yeah guys honestly i think that might be it vintage wise um 
I do have some boxes in there that I didn't really like dig through by any means, but I want to say that, I mean, this was the only thing I found that was vintage is this eternal tiara right here. Oh, it's so awesome. I can't wait to unbox this. This is brand new, by the way, like never, ever been opened. Like it still has the little plastic thing at the tip. Yeah, I think that'd be cool. Like, I don't know. I don't know how we would display that. Oh, you know what? You could just probably hang. <laughs> I have these. Yeah. There you go. You could just like chill right there or something. Also found the USJ doll. I needed to get that out of there. We can move these. Yeah, you know, that's totally vintage. I wonder though. No, oh, it should be fine on the hook. It won't wear it down, will it? It's not super heavy. I also have these that could come on out. Give me this. These are so strong. Maybe you could just hold it down a little. Maybe not. You kind of like it there though, like once I figure out a better way to keep it there, it kind of looks kind of cool. Like I said, not the most permanent display. Oh, that's why it's not sitting flat. Okay. My bad. There we go. We can just do something like take that plastic. behind it no yeah that works that works Look at these little funny bow sets those are cute Yeah, I am missing some stuff. Cause yeah, I have the super music box. It's gotta be somewhere in here. Like, unless it is still buried in there. I don't know. You know what guys? I think I just need to get some food and then come back down here and work on it some more. So I think that that's gonna be it for this video today, guys. Let me know what you thought of just hanging with me while I put some stuff on my shelves. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you haven't yet. Subscribe to the channel if you guys aren't already subscribed and check me out on my other socials if you want to, or just watch another video on my channel if you guys have time. I've got lots of great videos on my channel you may have missed and more videos coming on the way. Like I just got a pretty cool sponsor that I can't wait to produce that video. So that's coming soon to the channel. And that one will benefit you guys too, especially for first time users. So, ooh, can't wait to share that with you guys. But other than that, let me know what you thought about this video, if you enjoyed it, and maybe I'll do more as I go through this room. Maybe I'll do the Pokemon section with you guys, or I don't know, the rest of the Sailor Moon stuff, cause <laughs> y'all know I ain't done with that yet. <laughs> oh, it's taken me a long time. I don't know why. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys next time.